Question. A client with myasthenia gravis is receiving pyridostigmine. Several hours after a dose, the client suddenly develops severe muscle weakness, difficulty swallowing, and shallow respirations. The nurse is unsure whether this is a myasthenic crisis, underdose, or a cholinergic crisis, overdose. What is the priority nursing intervention? A. Administer the next scheduled dose of pyridostigmine immediately. B. Hold all cholinesterase inhibitors and prepare to administer atropine if ordered. C. Perform a tensilin edrophonium. Test at the bedside to distinguish the cause. D. Place the client in high Fowler's position and encourage deep breathing exercises. Answer. B. Hold all cholinesterase inhibitors and prepare to administer atropine if ordered. Rationale. Both myasthenic crisis, too low medication, and cholinergic crisis, too much medication, can present with severe muscle weakness and respiratory compromise, making them difficult to differentiate clinically. However, airway and breathing are the priority. Administering more pyridostigmine, option A, could be fatal if this is cholinergic crisis. The tensilin test, option C, is historically used, but it is not performed by nurses independently due to the risk of precipitating or worsening a crisis. Positioning and breathing exercises, option D, are supportive, but do not treat the underlying emergency. The safest priority is to withhold further doses, prepare for antidote therapy atropine, and notify the provider while ensuring airway support.